this question is resolve into partial fraction x square plus 1 upon x into bracket x square minus 1 by using partial fraction here we have first type of partial fraction that is x square plus 1 upon x into x square minus 1 so we put a upon x plus b upon x plus 1 plus c upon x minus 1 here x square minus 1 factor is x plus 1 x minus 1 so x square minus 1 factor is x plus 1 x minus 1 that is a square minus b square a plus b a minus b a square minus b square is equal to a plus b a minus b x square minus 1 is equal to x plus 1 x minus 1 so by using first type x square plus 1 upon x into x square a x minus 1 is equal to a into x plus 1 x minus 1 see this we put here a and multiply remaining denominators x plus 1 x minus 1 then b into we put b and remaining denominator x into x minus 1 and plus c here x into x plus 1 x into x plus 1 and denominator is x into x plus 1 into x minus 1 so these denominators get cancelled we get x square plus 1 is equal to a into x plus 1 x minus 1 plus b into x into x minus 1 and plus c into x into x plus 1 so we put equation 1 here after getting equation 1 we have to put values of x so we can find a b c so put first of all put x is equal to c what we have to put here x is equal to 0 and here also x is equal to 0 so we get b and c is omitted so put x is equal to 0 in equation 1 so x is equal to 0 plus 1 is equal to a into 0 plus 1 0 minus 1 plus b into 0 0 minus 1 plus c into 0 0 plus 1 now c 0 plus 1 1 a into 1 and 0 minus 1 here we get minus 1 c is 0 then whole term is 0 c here also 0 c is also 0 so we can omit this by putting 0 and here also 0 so we get 1 is equal to a into 1 into 1 minus 1 there is no need to read, write 0 here so we can get 1 upon minus 1 is equal to a so a is equal to minus 1 we get a is equal to minus 1 here now we have to find b we can put x is equal to c x plus 1 here also x plus 1 so a and c can omitted by putting minus 1 here in equation 1 so x is equal to minus 1 so here minus 1 square plus 1 is equal to a into minus 1 plus 1 minus 1 minus 1 minus 1 plus c into minus 1 minus 1 plus 1 so we get minus 1 square is plus 1 1 plus 1 and here a see this minus 1 plus 1 0 so there is no need to write a b minus 1 here and minus 1 minus 1 is minus 2 see this also here also minus 1 plus 1 so there is no need to write c also so we get 2 is equal to b into minus 2 into minus 1 that is 2 under 2 plus 2 and 
here 2 upon 2 we get b 2 by 2 is equal to 1 so b is equal to we get 1 b is equal to 1 so we get b here we have to calculate c so put x is equal to c this here x minus 1 and here also x minus 1 by putting 1 we can omit this a and b so x is equal to 1 in equation 1 so we get here 1 square is 1 plus 1 is equal to a into 1 plus 1 1 minus 1 plus b into 1 1 minus 1 and plus c is equal to into 1 1 plus 1 so we get 1 plus 1 is equal to 2 a is equal to 1 so there is no need to write a see this 1 minus 1 0 then whole term is 0 also see this b 1 minus 1 so here also we get 0 so there is no right to need to write a and b because that is 0 so c is equal to 1 and 1 plus 1 2 so we get 2 is equal to c 2 ones are 2 so we get 2 by 2 is equal to c here also we get 1 we get 1 here also we get c is equal to 1 so finally c is 1 we get values of a is equal to minus 1 b is equal to 1 and c is equal to 1 so put these values in this equation we get x square plus 1 x into x square minus 1 is equal to a we have a minus 1 upon x plus b 1 upon x plus 1 and plus c is 1 upon x minus 1 so finally we get this answer minus 1 upon x plus 1 upon x plus 1 plus 1 upon x minus 1